What's going on everybody? Today we're working on our 420cc turbocharged, electronically fuel injected drift trike. Man, that's a mouthful. It really is, yeah. dude. We're putting a blow off valve on it what? and some mufflers so we can <laughs> so we can hear the whoosh or whatever it is. Yeah, that sounds good. The plan the is plan. we are going to drill a hole somewhere in this pipe. In the here. charge pipe. And we are gonna put a little Hey buddy, how you doing? Feeling better. I'm gonna drill a hole and weld in a nipple. Okay. See. Which then we'll attach this thing to it with a rubber pipe. And I'm yep. thinking Thinking something somewhere around there or something. And a it, reminder to all the people on YouTube that it's Porsche. And it's a, Porsche. He said Porsche. It's a twin yeah, turbo. It's, it's uh, you Porsche. know the diff. Do you know the difference between a Porsche and a Porsche? One is the do thing. You know? you, one uh, is the thing right outside your house that people sit on and have rocking chairs. No. Do you know? No. No. Okay. About a hundred dollars an hour. Yeah. If you walk in and say, it's not Porsche, it's Porsche, boy, the price just went way on up. All right, let's take the pipe off. Let's get to drilling. Well, let's figure out where it's going to go. Oh, sure. It's going to be kind of like this. Eh. Kind of clutters, clutters it up, but what are you going to do? Yeah. We're How's that going? All right. Is that all the hole you need? Yeah. Can you show the people? Well, well the, the pipe that I'm using... Show me a hole. Right here. Sorry. I'm gonna paint these mufflers because the last one's rusted so fast. So these mufflers are from GoPowerSports.com. They're like $59 a piece, which is expensive. Um, but from what I understand, they are the best in keeping your high power. 212 quiet. What you doing, Ike? Oh, well, you welding? Okay. Uh, it's a little bit further back than I wanted, but it'll be fine. I wanted it like perfectly underneath. Yeah. I'm off a little bit. It'll be fine. I mean, it's just the drift right. How's it looking? I have a good feeling about this. Good. Well, I, I do know that we might not get all that we're expecting. I mean, I'm not expecting a huge Yeah, because the vacuum pulses are pulsy. Good, good steady. steady vacuum yeah. is what we would need for for a great working pop-off valve. I'm just hoping that we'll get something. If not, then oh well. it'll look cool. Yeah. These blow-off valves depend on vacuum to suck, to open. Right. To get that <laughs> If we don't have a nice vacuum, we're not gonna get a great <laughs> But we're gonna find out. Maybe there's enough, uh, when we shut the, throttle, let off the throttle, maybe there's going to be enough vacuum from from the engine dragging down to get a good, yeah. It isn't still pushing off, is it? Good. All right, back or there. I think I like back better. Yep. Well, we just got the uh, blow-off valve installed, and I'm fixing to go for a ride and see if we get any uh, blow-off.
took two pipes that fit on the uh, mufflers and I ovaled them and put them in the Harley Davidson exhaust and we're gonna weld it up right there and the exhaust is gonna come out at angles all right we got the uh, mufflers installed kind of crazy oh looking. yeah <laughs> you want to hear what it sounds like let's hear what it sounds like Come on, guy. There you go. Be free. Well, I guess we're uh, doing some performance benchmarking. <laughs> Man, they already know that's just code for taking it down the road. I guess we're going to do some playing around with it today. Just do some cool riding and cool shots and show off the fine muffler we fine exhaust we made the for dual it. mufflers man dual <laughs> exhaust that thing looks ridiculous <laughs> that's the idea yeah <laughs> we think we might have heard it work but i've come to the conclusion we're not going to get a whole lot of out of it because it's a one cylinder engine we Too might much get pulse the vacuum pulse is just we don't have a, a steady vacuum so if we don't have a steady vacuum, that valve's not gonna work correctly. So we're probably bleeding off a little bit of the pressure, but just not a lot. Not, not enough, enough to, to hear, hear it. it. Yeah. So. making this up but you might be able to hear the tiniest amount of flutter whenever you let off the gas mm -hmm. it's just like mm -hmm. tiny mm -hmm. your turn
out of gas. It's it's got plastic wheels on it. It's not like it was going fast. I don't care the way you came by here. This, this is not a racetrack. Yes, sir. got to find a place to ride yeah go-karts what do you say something about how this isn't a racetrack yeah i seen how you drive by here all sideways mm -hmm. it's not a racetrack i wasn't going that fast yeah i was going slower than people come through the neighborhood oh yeah and just because i was going sideways drifting it's a racetrack so you ran it out of gas though huh yeah that's what we get for putting a tiny little gas tank on there. I was trying to do a 360, man. Yeah, I know. And then I ran it out of gas. I'm a little upset. They look cool. Uh, I was a little disappointed I didn't get to pull off a 360. And just because I came sliding around a corner at a low speed, it's a racetrack. Well, the noise probably has to do with it too. It's still kind of noisy, <sighs> even though it's got some sweet mufflers from Go Power Sports on it. Now I'm upset. Yep. We're going to have to go to a happy place. Where's that? Probably Rat Rod Wagon. Okay, well, let's yeah. work on the Rat Rod Wagon. So, we installed a blow-off valve from a 911 turbo on this thing, and I don't think it does anything. <laughs> Maybe, like, it has the smallest, tiniest flutter that you can only hear when you're riding it because your head is right there. But, you know, that might just be myself trying to tell myself that it did something. No, I think I hear it too. Yeah. But tiny. Uh, there's not enough vacuum in the uh, system to pull off, pull that. It's not the vacuum. Right. It's, it's the, the pulse. pulse. Yeah. So... What we're hearing was probably the valve just, just pulsing open just the tiniest little bit. Yeah. Uh, it'd probably work great on a two-cylinder engine, but not a one-cylinder. Yeah. You Should know what that, thought about that. You know what everyone's going to say. Everyone's going to be like, put a turbo on the 670. Anyway, it'll be fine. Yeah, it'll be fine. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram at Cars and Cameras Reviews. Check out our blog and website at cars-cameras.com. Let us know what else this needs. Uh, I think it's pretty close to completion. We just need to enjoy it now, now that we've been told off. <laughs> what are you gonna do? I mean, he is technically in the right because this is an un unregistered vehicle and that's a public street. What are you gonna do? Thanks for watching everybody. We'll see you in the next one. Hey look, I'm surfing.